Sick of being tied down, tethered, and all knotted up? Well, welcome to the brave new future that we were always promised. It comes without wires, and you're gonna love it. Here's your flight fix. Welcome to the Cirrus Approach Flight Fix, the bite-sized flight training show dedicated to those pilots who never stop learning. This magical little card, the Flight Stream 510 card, well, it packs quite a punch because it wirelessly connects you, well, actually your mobile device, it connects your mobile device to your Perspective Plus avionics. So, say goodbye to those days of plugging in your trusty old laptop and logging into the FBO Wi-Fi only to curse the exceedingly cumbersome task of ejecting and transferring SD cards and instead take a more hands-free approach where database updates automatically beam down to your mobile device, once they're available of course, and then they patiently sit there and wait until you send them to your avionics. So let's leave this wired jungle behind and explore the open air, free range, organic, non-tethered benefits of the Flightstream 510 to the hangar. To enjoy the freedom of a wireless cockpit, you'll need a few things. First, a Flightstream 510 card that is installed into the bottom slot of your MFD. And second, you're gonna need a mobile device running the trusty Garmin Pilot app. Finally, you're gonna need a proper introduction between those two things. So, on your MFD, head over to the AUX page group, then scroll down to the Connects Setup page. It's important to understand that any time this page is displayed, the Flightstream 510 is officially discoverable. Follow the prompts and bam, just like that, you're a matchmaker. This page is also where you can confirm the connection status of paired devices, so enabling or disabling Auto Connect, a handy feature that'll recognize your device the next time you bring it along for an airplane ride. But a word of caution on that, Authorizing too many devices to auto-reconnect could mean that Bluetooth control might automatically transfer from one device to another. So to avoid playing digital musical chairs with your phone and your tablet, take a quick peek at this page before you taxi out to confirm that you in fact have your desired device connected. And now that you're all paired up, you've got a direct and totally wireless link to your avionics. And that means you can do a whole lot. For starters, you can send flight plans wirelessly right to your Perspective Plus avionics, helping you save time and fend off any pesky and, of course, totally accidental typos from sneaking into your flight plan. And it also means you can quickly prepare even the most complex flight plan ahead of time made while comfortably lounging around on your favorite couch rather than loading the entire flight plan under the watchful and always judging eyes of waiting passengers. When it comes to tuning in your favorite 90s rock or easy listening XM music station for a little in-flight entertainment, well, take your hand off that dial. And by that, of course, I mean use the Garmin Pilot app to control XM radio right there on your mobile device instead of spinning dials and flipping through pages on the MFD. Lastly, your mobile device can now interface directly with GPS, ATAHARS, traffic, and weather information. So what that means to you is that you're basically turning your device into a sort of secondary multi-function display right there in the palm of your hand. So if you really want to connect with your avionics, there's just no better answer than going wireless. Now don't forget, if you want to take a more in-depth dive into your avionics, Head over to CirrusApproach.com and check out the 60-some-odd videos in the Video Avionics course. And if you want to make me listen for a change, well, be sure to comment on this video or send comments, questions, biting critiques, or loving praise to learning at CirrusAircraft.com. Hi, my name is Randy Peterson, and I'm an independent CSIP here in Sioux Falls, South Dakota. This is my son, Max. We are here today pre-flighting in the hangar because it's cold in South Dakota. All right, learning is a lifestyle. See you at the next fix.